So here we are at the historic James Black Dewey Heritage Festival here in Washington, Arkansas. And here is one of our makers, Shane. Tell us what you brought to the table today. How you doing? Uh, so I got a lot of different things. Uh, some of the things that I've made just kind of experimenting with, these are all for display, but a big old cleaver uh, with all the hammered uh, for root to forge in there and a nice little uh, forged in hook <clears throat> to display. Uh, a rasp bowie, I always want to do. It's got a nice piece of Turkish walnut on there, and then a piece of uh, canvas micarta guard. Just kind of messing around with that. This one I was mainly messing around just to contour that handle and just kind of see what I could do with that. I really like how that turned out. Uh, but mainly what I do is right here in the center table. Uh, these are usually my the ones I do the most of. I call some of these my Brewsters, which is named up at uh, early 1930s and 40s aeronautical uh, Air, American Aeronautical Company because uh, I'm retired Air Force so a lot of this is military related Air Force related uh, but I like to use a lot of G10 micarta uh, synthetic type materials just because to me you can almost personalize them a lot to, to different individuals you know and make them different colors and everything but a lot of my blades are leaf spring, but this is ADCRV2 <coughs> with uh, uh, maple burl handle, and then it's got a F16 carbon fiber brake rotor uh, bolster on there. I like to use that a lot. I got that over here too. That's where, with from the military, Air Force, and aircraft mechanic, I used to rebuild the brakes. So. This is actually a donation knife that I did for the local local gun shop and the VFW here in Arkansas for the Gold Star Kids Foundation. And so that'll go to them and buy tickets for that there. Uh, but I like doing a lot, of, a lot of different things. This is a hidden tang, but with a frame. It's hard to see in this light, but it's got a, a frame handle on it with G10. And then it's got a green, uh, burlap micarta handle on there and then I did this since we're since we're here at the James Black Festival and the James Black School of Bladesmithing this is actually the Bowie that I forged uh, during the veterans class that they had sponsored back in November and this is what I did and it's kind of to go along with this guy this is my competition cutter that I just used uh, this is actually made out of a Jeep leaf spring I'm a Jeep guy but got the brute de forge on there. It's got the F16 carbon fiber handle. Uh, these are kind of like my good Bowie, bad Bowie. Kind of like the old westerns, you know, good cowboy, bad cowboy. So, but that's me. So how can we get a hold of you? So you can get a hold of me through either Facebook or Instagram. On Facebook, it's just Shank Knives. It's with one K, Shane Frank Knives. That's kind of how I came up with that. And on Instagram, it's underscore Shank Knives underscore. And that's what I got right now. So that's uh, hopefully get a website here this year sometime. But that's that's me. Well, very good. Thank you for your service. All right. I appreciate uh, remember, it. I used to jump out of what you used to fix. <laughs> right. And on that bombshell, have a nice day.